Hi, I'm Beth Curland, and today I'd like to offer you a really short and simple practice of just noticing and naming emotions. And it sounds quite simple, but actually there's a lot of powerful science behind the fact that when we can just notice and name what we're experiencing, it can actually help take and dial down the intensity out of whatever that is so that we're not so caught in the middle of an emotion, we're able to step, take that half step back and observe what's happening. So as you go through your day to notice, and it's easy for us to maybe just kind of say, oh, I'm angry, but bring a little bit of curiosity to whatever that is. So first of all, the noticing in the first place, and then as you name it to really take some interest in, is this anger? Is this frustration? Is this irritation? Am I feeling hurt? Am I feeling disappointed? Something else going on so that you really become um, more skillful at differentiating some of these little nuances of our emotions. And then just pause for a moment. You might put your hand on your heart. If you're in a place where you can do that, you feel comfortable doing that. And to just uh, breathe for a moment, to just let yourself notice and experience whatever that sensation is in your body and how it's showing up. And then you might move forward into your day. And you can practice this with more difficult emotions. You could also, also practice this with more renewing and replenishing emotions. You know, when you're aware of feeling um, a moment of calm or peace, those are really moments to savor and take in. And so that can be powerful to pause and do this with that as well. And I hope this is useful for you as you go forward into your day and into your week. Take good care.